All right, hey, I know it's been a while, but I just wanted to make this quick one. Sorry about that. The light fucked that up. But recently, UFC was having a versus fight. Nate Marquardt versus Ryan, Rick Story. Rick, yeah, Rick Story. Sorry about that. Um, and I don't know who else is hurt, but I found out today that not only has Ryan Nate Marquardt been removed from this fight and any further fights, but he's been playing up fucking fire from the UFC. So far, all I've read is that he was, he didn't, or not that I read, there was a video of Dana White saying that he didn't pass his medical examination. He wasn't cleared for it. But the way he was saying it, it sounded like it was something way worse. Because the way, the tone of Dana's voice, he was fucking pissed. Like, I'm telling you, you check it out. I'll, if, if I do... If I see anything else up there, I'll make another, I'll let you all know, but it's fucking crazy. Um, for the Rick Story fans, he still is fighting, he's fighting another dude, uh, can't remember the name off the top of the, the name off, the dude, I don't know his opponent's name off the top of my head, but Chet Congo and Pat Barry, uh, excuse me, uh, and Pat Barry have moved, been moved to the main card, so... I'm still trying to figure out what happened. Um, one of my friends, she said that he lied, that Nate lied about a bunch of stuff. Um, I haven't heard anything else other than the, the medical suspension. That's what I've heard. But the lying thing, I don't know. Um, so, as far as I know, he's never fighting in the UFC again. Now, he may get signed to Strike Force, which, is, I mean, that's not a bad deal either. But still, I don't know what he did to fuck up in the UFC. But I don't know if he can ever make amends with Dana and just the UFC in general. That would be awesome. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know about you, but I'm going to be watching this fight tomorrow night. Um, <clears throat> my money is on Pat Barry. Um, but I'm not putting out Czech Congo. Chet Congo's a bad motherfucker. So, I think Pat Barry may win via kick, because he's, he's known for his kickboxing and all that. But, if Chet Congo wins, that would be awesome too, because I, I love Chet Congo. He's fucking awesome. I'd like to see him go for the belt one day. Um, and, I think in the Pat Barry, or not Pat Barry, sorry, Matt Mitrione and Christian Moorcraft fight, I think, uh, Matt's got it, because he's got some big fucking hands. So, um, we'll see. Who else is fighting? Tyson Griffin, Joe, Liz uh, Joe Stevens, and uh, Joe Liz is it Lozano. I think they're all fighting, and I think they're all, they'll all do good. But, <clears throat> that's all I got for y'all right now. Um, I'll make another one when the Faber versus Cruz 2 fight comes up. I'm hyped for that. That's a big fucking card. The title fight. Lieben versus uh, Silva. Um, Melvin Gallard's fighting. Shit, I'm fucking pissed at myself. I can't remember the rest. Anybody else on here? No? Um, it's a big car fight. I'm, I'm sorry. I shouldn't be this fucking flustered. But, uh, yeah. Um, July 2nd. I'll see y'all then. That was kind of douchey. Uh, I, I feel like an asshole now. See ya.